Greetings everybody, Black Soul here, and welcome to another introduction video. You didn't have them for some time, I made myself a few days break. And this time uh, it is for Burning Wheel. Also, as I noticed, I'm not planning on taking all, all of these role-playing systems at once. One at a time, some of them I might be able to play like only like in the far future, like in a f several years. But for now, in the case of the Burning Wheel, it's a fantasy role-playing game independently written and published by Luke Crane. And it uses a dice pool mechanic and it always uses a standard six-sided dice for task resolution and character create generation system. That's basically really huge because it tracks your history, experiences, new characters from beer to the point they begin adventuring. So it's a lot. And the book, as I was told, has like 700 or 800 pages and it's majorly about mechanic. It's not like... default setting is fantasy, but the book itself, Burning Quill, doesn't have like specific information of settings. Uh, they release like their own like dedicated settings later, uh, like Under a Serpent Sun, Burning Sun Jihad or Blossoms Are Falling. But yeah, if you want that, if you get a Burning Wheel book, that's only like setting, and it's a lot of information. The system, it's a lot, like you have to spend some time to get through it. Probably the same as Anima, but as I heard, if you do that and if it goes and if it works, then it works flawlessly. Like it uh, allows you to create really awesome characters with great like uh, character progression, and you can create nice stories. But yeah, that's the case that this is one of the systems that requires a lot of time to learn. Still, maybe hopefully some day I'll be able to uh, play a session or two. So, stay tuned. I see you guys next time. Bye bye.